So, hello guys. Uh, in the last video, we end up here. We need to make the presentation of the bike a moving location, so let's do it. First of all, sorry. First of all, let's go to view menu display over here. Go to loads and moving loads. I need to see them. Make this visible. Okay, apply. Now we need to choose the moving crane load here and activate this and this. Sorry about that, this one here. And there we go. We have here the moving load and if I turn this off, you can see this very, you can see this green thick line, which is just the root of the root of this loads here okay you may see that okay i think you've got the idea behind this presentation so let's go let's select the current component will be component number four here oh sorry component number four also you may check these little forces here the braking forces I think you need we will have a little difficult to see that but they are here as you may see okay the braking forces uh, now let's go to load select case component I could also press this I could go to load select case component that's what I have done select case number four okay Let's close. Uh, no, I don't need to close. I need to go to loads, set case component, case number four, animation. And start an animation. And you may see that robot makes a very cool animation of the load on his several components, step by step, shown here. Okay? I think you've got the idea. Now I'm going to stop this close close this once again go back to component number four uh, okay let's go to the analysis the results analysis let's go to here diagram for bars moving green load no I'm sorry I'm going to results here results over here okay I'm going to select the moving green load I'm going to turn on the MY moment, apply, and there you have all the bending moments on the several elements of the structure and I'm going also to turn on the deformation. And look what I can do now, I can make an animation out of this. Okay, I could go to loads menu. this component and just press this button create an animation and in this animation everything changes the loads the bending moments and the deformation of the structure is really cool this is really really cool okay now let's close this also close this turn this off and also turn this off apply okay go back to start and in the next in the next video we will be doing and we will be talking about one thing called influence lines uh, I, I don't think that it is exactly what you are waiting for but we will talk about that in that later movie just one thing over here you've got moving crate load with a plus in front of it and moving clean load with a minus in front of it i'm not going to worry about this because we are going to talk about this in a later movie okay you don't need to worry about that you 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 just need to understand that this moving load case is a compound let's say let's 
put it that way it's a compound load with 10 different components okay and when you've got loads like this you can make animations you can change the position and you, you can actually design all the elements based on this compound load so thank you for watching